conservative new media viewers around the world, we just finished watching the Oscars and they've been announced the whole situation from top to bottom. Now I don't have a ton to say about this and PFV may have little or nothing to say about this. But let's just recap this. We've got the King's Speech that won the big awards. Best Actor, Best Picture, uh, I don't know about the other awards, whatever like that, but you know, because uh, I just, me personally, I can't watch the Oscars start to finish, dude. I can just only just watch just little snippets here and there, whatever like that. And, uh, you know, the thing is, is like, okay, here's my thoughts about the whole situation. Social Network was pumped, dude. A lot of people were all pumped up about that. Look, I watched that. It was a great story. I love the story of it. Justin Timberlake was great, whatever like that. I didn't think the main actor was that great. I mean, he just seemed to sort of be acting kind of like himself, whatever. I didn't think that was great acting. That's my personal opinion. All our personal opinion, all that, any facts, guys, any aspersions, chicks, disclaimers, you know that. Uh, Franco, 127 hours, didn't even see it. Don't really want to see it. I mean, it's, it's kind of like, whatever. Uh, Fighter looks good. I didn't watch that yet, but I do want to watch that. That didn't seem, you know, didn't seem to win the big ones there. And see, here's the thing, like, with the whole the King's speech. And I haven't watched that either. It's like, I don't care about that. It's like, okay, someone had a hard time with the speech and then he did okay, like, whatever. There's some big actors and actors and actresses in there. I love the way that if you, <laughs> doesn't it seem funny to you that, like, if you have a, a British accent or something like that, you're automatically, like, a, a much more, a better actor or something like that? <laughs> How does that work? I don't understand about that. That's, that's sort of interesting. Um, Christian Bale, he's always amazing. No doubt about that. That guy's like intense and he is a great actor. There's no doubt about that. And the thing is like, it just seemed kind of boring to me, dude. It just seemed like, I don't even, does anyone care about Hollywood anymore? That's what I want to know. It seems like it's just kind of going like whatever. And maybe like some of Hollywood people kind of rebelled against the whole social network because it's all about the new media now, dude, with YouTube and Facebook and everything else like that. And their little film stuff is kind of like, who cares anymore? You know, I don't know, dude. What do you think about that? Now, Paul, I know you didn't even watch this. We don't really like the whole Oscars. It just seems kind of like boring and old school to us. I mean, do you have a reaction to this whole situation? Yeah, I'm one of the people that, and I saw this on Twitter, uh, like Jay Adade, who you know, he's our guy, yeah. and uh, other people, including Michael Vick, and some other stars were like, look, you know, I'm not watching the Oscars, I'm watching uh, Miami Heat versus New York Knicks. Exactly. And I was one of those people. I mean, he even had, you know, Spike Lee in the uh, film world uh, at the game himself in person. So, no, I, look, uh, you know, I think the Oscars are basically a, a PR fest, a public relations fest for Hollywood, pat themselves on the back, promote their movies some more, and then after they give the awards, you know, the movies will get more sales and videos and stuff. Uh, I don't, I think a view it is something that's mostly uh, a show that um, a lot of women like to watch uh, without putting anybody down. Uh, if you like watching it, that's great. If people want to see what people are wearing and this type of a thing, it really holds almost no interest to me at all. Uh, but I know you're watching it kind of followed a little bit who was winning what. I have heard good things about the King's speech. Uh, you know, we talked about it, both thought it was going to win Best Picture before right. it did. Um, that's about it, you know. I know that you know the Oscars and Hollywood in general are kind of fading, and and so this is, I think Hollywood is trying to use this more and more to kind of uh, keep their relevance. Yeah, I think that's right, and, I, and, and, and 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 like you said, we're not making fun of anyone. That's the demographic. That's what the ratings say. That's that's who the, the audience, whom the audience seems to be, well, in what we believe, anything like that. And if you like it, then that's great. Just like you know, I mean, you know, you're gonna have a certain demographic if you're talking about WWE or something like that. It's gonna be a different demographic, and there, or, or a video game show or anything, you know. So that's just the way that it is, and that's fine. And you know, we did see here that Christian Bale did win. Uh, in the fighter, that's great. You know, Christian Bale's no joke. He's for real. He's a great actor. Hey, this is a big win for UK uh, actors and stuff like that. It's a big pump up for them and stuff like that. So that that's sort of interesting right there. I do think that it's kind of getting more boring and stuff and going down. I don't know. The King's Speech obviously had you know a bunch of people in there that are, are, are heavyweight, so that's cool. I don't think there was a lot of other. You know, I mean, there wasn't. This wasn't a year. It was like, wow, it's a great movie. In my personal opinion. You know what I mean? Like, there was things that I enjoyed and stuff like that, but I mean, the, you know, the movies that I like to see now are basically, you have to have something that's like ama amazingly great if I'm going to go to a movie theater, or more like, you know, the stuff that I love, like the Marvel comic stuff, you know, Iron Man and all that type of stuff, uh, uh, or Transformers, stuff like that. That's stuff that's, 
that, that, that I'll go to a movie theater for, okay? That's a different type of situation. But what do you think about that? I want to hear from the people that watch this. I want to hear from the people that are upset that Social Network didn't win. I want to hear from some of the people that looked at the fashion who had the best dress, worst dress, this type of If you're into that. You know, and I want to hear from some people that, uh, you know, that, that are happy with. Uh, give me all the mix, but you tell me what's up. The headline is Social Network facialed big win for UK uh, actors and, uh, and actresses and stuff like that, I believe. Or at least the acting community, let's say. The acting community over there in the UK. King's Speech, big winner. And then uh, uh, Christian Bale also wins. And there's a lot of other stuff there too. And I'm trying to, I don't want to forget anyone here. I'm trying to figure out uh, who won for um, best actress or supporting actress. Whatever. I, I don't know. Check it all out. It's going to be in the description. We'll put the links down there. Check it out. You tell me what's up. Comments below. Subscribe above. I'm John D. Villarreal. Rate this video high. Subscribe to all of our stuff. Check out all of our related videos. And we will see you next time.